Greg was born in 1964. All the civil rights stuff was going on at the time. I didn't even know what muscular dystrophy was. And then he followed that up by saying there was no cure for it. And he had his control mounted on his footrest. The next thing I know, he's got some gal living in the house with him. It's something we're calling facilitated sex. It was easy for me. I had never loved any man until I met Greg and was with Greg. I helped him quite a bit because I was personal care attendant. I was helping him get out the tub and helping him get dressed. He knew he wanted to host a radio show someday, and he did it, and I was not going to stop him. He dealt with race issues. He dealt with civil rights issues. He dealt with human interest issues. People were out there listening. Yeah, you know, I became abusive to Greg. I slapped him around a couple of times when he wouldn't listen to me. And the police said, you know, this lady needs to be taken away. And that's when I said, okay, I'll take the kids. He ignores the fact that he's disabled. Take the stand. And sees himself as another man. 